will be in action as well throughout this campaign. But a first chance to kick the ball competitively here this afternoon. Up it goes towards that people expect it again the next season. Well, exactly. And um, it's a continuation of uh, the development here. And you've got to keep pushing on and trying to make progress. Fantastic season. Last, last season, it's just a case now of getting in the starting 11 a little bit more often this season. Only five starts from last campaign. But still managed three goals. Yeah, he done well when he uh, played last season. Kieran McKenna, who was the main man in the dugout last term, he stepped up to join Jose Mourinho's coaching staff. Neil Ryan, someone who's had. <coughs> and then it's Callum Minkley who goes back to his goalkeeper, Sam French. Bit of a heavy touch which might allow Manchester United in here. Elanga for Greenwood. And French has to dig himself and his team out of trouble there. Shouts have had Rory Delap for the past four years or so, but this summer. Rory Delap's moved to be one of the first team coaches at Stoke City alongside Gary Rowett. Here's Greenwood. Ramazani with him. Elanga as well. Greenwood goes alone. United under 18s are up and running for the season. And no surprise that it's Mason Greenwood doing it. Then react when the ball skids and it's gone. But the main thing is a good cross coming in and bodies into the box. And that creates problems for the opposition. I know that many. It's almost like a standing jump. You can't generate any power on the ball. Well, I was talking to the England under-17 coaching staff about him. Just go. Here goes Pujmal, though, trying to reinstate the lead straight away, and it's Greenwood! Well, that would have been remarkable. And it's the old cliche as if Derby were so delighted to get back on terms, they forgot to turn themselves back on from kickoff. Neil Ryan's side almost profiting from that. So prominent last season with this Manchester United side. 42 goals scored in the final 15 games of the season in all competitions. Normally so reliable in front of goal. But the goalkeeper has the answer to his question here. And Manchester United pass up the chance to go into the break in the lead. For that because we've seen, well, we've seen all, all summer top players missing penalties in important games uh, at the World Cup so he shouldn't let that worry him and I'm sure he won't hey, but it was a very handy penalty save to keep Mason Greenwood from scoring his second and now Traore who started in an attacking vein and it's Greenwood who's in the middle didn't quite get the connection he wanted and French got in the way excellent ball from Williams there from McGee has joined Greenwood in the middle. Ramazani might go it alone. It was a terrific effort, and Sam French watched it all the way onto his gloves. Up a little bit now. It's beginning to surface. soak in a little bit, yeah. As I say, we don't want to complain too much because uh, lots of room here for Ramazani. Tries to try and hit in the middle, but it was dealt with by Derby, although. Brandon Williams now tries to make something of it. It's a good run. Oh, it's found a way through. How on earth did that one go in? Seemed to have no real pace. Some real worth out of you. Sometimes that's uh, one of the... There he might have a chance. The cross might come in. Levitt, lovely reverse ball. Goalkeeper was favourite to get there though, and indeed he did beat Ramazani. From the challenge, United have numbers forward here. Greenwood! Powerfully beaten away by French, and he needed to be sharp at his near post there to stop United taking the lead for a third. And all this game goes on with the scoreline this way, that penalty save hope more than expectation wasn't it Daniel Hitchell never really wavered from the start to giving a goal kick there it's towards Greenwood as well to keep it moving and pulls it back for Alanga it was perhaps put off by the tackle that was coming in on him just has gone 
chasing after the ball someone's filled in that slot which is exactly how it should be but you don't always see it with young players do you no you don't it's a, it's a learning process uh, that comes with the more games you towards uh, the players development isn't it that saying if you do get booked in a game you are then one of those who is likely to be taken off because there's always that danger that one more time hopefully get a winner Ramazani McCann for Greenwood who goes for it once again French gets in the way if Derby Art right, by Hockenhull Ramasani saw the run of Greenwood it's a delicious ball to find him can he find the net yes he can once again United nudge themselves in front a beautifully crafted nicely away from Archie Brown there are a few waiting for the ball and he picks out McCann, who can't quite tuck it inside the post. Done great there. I tell by the keeper's reaction, French is scrambling over there. He's wanting that to go wide, which it did do. Onto the left foot, thinking about the right foot, maybe. Brings Ramazani into play. It's another terrific curling effort from him, which looked destined for the top corner. Done well again, Greenwood holding up this time. This time he gets support, rolls it wide. Fantastic curling effort. Traore for Ethan Laird, who might fancy this. Instead, he puts it on there for Mason Greenwood. And the goalkeeper, I think, was caught there. Good play there. McCann, McCann. pestering McCann. Callum Minkley. He's not expecting that. made the late run. And it's just as well Thompson got sliding back there. It might have been a chance for McCann there. French needs to get the ball up there towards 